Hello everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In previous video, I have already shown you how to take runtime permission from the user to access the internal storage of the device. And I have also shown you how to fetch all the PDF files available in our device and show this in the recycler view. So if you have not watched the video, then just go to description there. I put the link for my previous video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to perform a click operation on this particular PDF or any of this so that this PDF will be open in a new activity and we can read it, zoom it. And I'm also going to show you a new design for a particular PDF. Okay, so I'm going to minimize this. After this, first thing what we have to do is we have to create one interface. So right click on this, click on new and select class. Here you have to select this interface and inside this one, I'm going to name this interface on PDF selection. PDF selected listener or select listener. Hit enter. This will create a new interface. Interface only contains the declaration, not the body of any method. So I'm going to define one method or declare one method over here. So on PDF selected. Inside this one, we have to write file and so into accept you have to just click alt enter press alt enter and now the task for this one is done let me just close this after this we have to move to this activity that is main adapter inside this one first i'm going to create one variable for this on pdf select listener so private and inside this one we have to write on pdf select listener and i'm going to name this one listener like this one so we have to create a matching constructor for all of these three. So I'm going to delete this one and either you can right click on this and click on refactor, not refactor, generate, or you can simply click uh, press alt and insert in your keyboard and click on this constructor, select these all three and click on OK. This will create a matching constructor. If this one error is showing in your device, so not to worry about this, we are going to resolve this. Okay. After this, we have to move inside this on bind view holder. Here we have to create a click listener for that particular view. So I'm going to write this holder dot card view and inside this one, we have to set on click listener and new view on click listener. Inside this one, we have to simply type listener dot on PDF selected. And inside this one, we have to pass PDF files dot get from where we get the position that is in the, this position variable. Here you can see this. With the help of this position, we can fetch a particular PDF file and we can identify which PDF is being clicked. Okay. After this, we have to simply move into the main activity here inside this one. And here, as this is an interface, so we need here we have only the body declaration, sorry, method declaration. We need a body for this one. So I'm going to implement that method inside this one. So this is a main activity, extend this one. So I'm going to implement methods implement interface actually so implement on pdf selected listener and when we write this will show an error because the method is not implemented so click on this and click on implement method select the first one and click on ok here you can see this on pdf selected it's showing an error so we are going to resolve this not to worry so we have to pass this over here only like this and the issue is resolved here you can see this no issue is remaining if i move back over here the issue is resolved so i'm going to close this one and inside this on PDF selected, we need to start a new activity. So I'm going to create a new activity inside this one. So click on this, click on activity and select an empty activity. And I'm going to name this one PDF activity. So I'm going to change from main activity to PDF activity and click on finish. This will create a new activity. Here we have this. Now move back inside this one and here we have to write a few line of code so that we, when we click on that, we move to this PDF activity. In the main act I'm right now I'm in the main activity and here I'm going to write start activity. This one. Inside this one we have to write new intent. Inside this one we have to pass main activity, the current one where we are dot this and where we have to move to the PDF activity dot class after this we have to simply just start this activity before we start we have to put something inside this one so put extra and we have to put the path so i'm going to 
put the path inside this one so comma file dot get absolute path like this okay showing an error why let's check it rename reference okay it's showing an error because we have to put this all just cut it and we have to put it over here just paste it and here you can see this now the error is resolved now we have to put the colon over here now if i start this time our application and let's check we try to click on this one so now it's greater build is running so it's installing and when i click on this we are on the new activity in the new activity we haven't designed anything okay so inside this one we have to actually add before we start anything we have to view the pdf file okay so before we start coding further first we have to add one dependency inside this one build.gradle inside this one we have to add one dependency that is for android pdf viewer you can visit this link or i'm going to put this link in the description of this video so that you can access it over here so with the help of this android pdf viewer you can actually view the pdf so i'm going to add this dependency so i'm going to copy this line and move back over here and paste it over here and click on sync now and now i'm going to start this and let's check if there is any issue in our application so here you can see this if this happens in your system then not to worry i'm going to show you how to resolve this issue why this one is happening because we have added this new dependency it contains some method which is already present in some other dependency. So it's showing duplicate class is available inside this one. So to resolve this issue, we have to actually make one line of change into this cradle.property. So move back over here and here we have to put one small stuff, one single line. You can visit this link, yeah, this one. We have to just put this one. Android.enable jettifier is equal to true. What is this? The Android plugin automatically migrates existing third party libraries to use Android X by rewriting their binaries. So when we, I use this, I'm not going to use any dependency. The duplicate class issue will be resolved when I put it in my properties. So gradle.property inside this one, we have to put this. I'm going to paste this one and click on sync now. And now I'm going to restart the application. Now let's check. This time if this one is working fine or not. So here you can see this. Now we don't have any issue. It means that this one is working fine. Now we can use the dependency. Okay, so let me just close this one too and move back over here to this one. That is, we have designed this activity underscore PDF and inside this one, we have to add a PDF viewer. So first thing I'm going to change this constraint layout to relative layout. So change this one to relative layout inside this one i'm going to add one pdf viewer so we have added this dependency for this pdf viewer and now i'm using that one so this will be match parent and match parent and we have to set one id for this one so i'm going to set the id to pdf viewer or i can simply say pdf view and just close this and now the design is ready we don't need to make any changes inside this one after this we have to simply move to this PDF activity so double click on this and here what we have to do is we have actually passed the path from here in the main activity we have passed the path on which we have clicked the PDF move back over here so that I can make you then you can easily understand so whenever I click on this the path for this file is being passed inside this one whenever the new activity is uh, new activity is being open or being started we are passing a values inside that that is the exact path of this one so i'm going to extract that path from the intent so here i'm going to take one variable that is a string and this is file path and initially it will be null okay move back over here and here i'm going to just type pdf pdf view Okay, showing an issue because we haven't created, we haven't imported this library for this one. So PDF view and we have to press Alt Enter, import class. So this will import this class. If you can't able to do like the same, so you can directly write it over here. After this, we have to write PDF view is equal to 
find view by id r dot id and we have set the id for this one is pdf view so i'm going to use that pdf view inside this one after this we have to extract the file path so file path is equal to get intent dot get string extra and we have used the key that is path so this is the variable this is the name of the path here you can see this we have set the name you have to write exactly same if any letter is in capital then you also have to write that letter in capital over here after this we have to simply open that file so file file is equal to new file and said this one we have to pass a file path after this we have to just create a uri object so uri and i'm going to name this one path press alt enter so that it can import the library or import the class so is equal to uri dot from file and we have to pass the file now i pass this and simply we have to start this pdf view dot from uri inside this one we have to pass the path and dot load now our task for this one is done let's start this and let's check if our, i can open the pdf file or not so i've started the application here you can see this install is done now i'm going to click on this and here you can see this now my pdf file is open and you can also read and zoom out and zoom in okay so then the task is done if you are satisfied with this view then it's totally fine i'm going to show you how to design a new view for this one so let's stop this and we have to move back inside this one that is activity rv underscore item and here we have to make few changes so that i'm going to change the design for this one so first thing move back to this layer linear layout and here we have to make changes in the height and width so width is match parent that's totally fine i'm going to change this one to 80 dp okay not worry not to worry just keep following me okay and change this orientation from vertical to horizontal like this one i'm going to give a new view to each item okay after this move inside this one image view and i'm going to change the height and width so i'm going to change the height width to 80 dp and i'm going to change the height to 50 dp here you can see that this one is looking nice okay after this we don't need to make any changes inside this one we have to move to this text view and here we have to make one small changes few small changes this match height make this one match parent sorry layout height make this one match parent and here you can see this after this we have to simply make one small change that is we have to send set the layout gravity or simply the gravity this one to center center vertical this one and now this text is in the center now if i start the application still it will look odd for sure here you can see this we have three like this but this one is not looking nice so why this one is happening we have changed all the design because if you move to this one that is main activity here you can see this we have set the recycler view dot set layout manager so how many columns you want so i have set this three change this one to one and restart the application and move back inside this one here you can see this this one is looking much better than that one if you are satisfied with that then don't no need to make changes if you like this one then you can keep this so that's it for this video guys we have completed this period days pdf reader if i'm going to click on this this is still will open okay so just subscribe and share with your friends and thanks for watching just keep supporting and keep loving us